Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough and we are going to finish off level 3, the butter building, right now with Mr. Shine and Mr. Bright. And as you can see, one goes up there, the other attacks you like that, and you can only attack one at a time. Uh, normally you would have to, oh shoot, suck in their stars like that. Oh no, I wanted my power, well that's okay I guess. Uh, I already did quite a bit of damage to them I have to say, that was dang fast. Um, so, Mr. Shine and Mr. Bright here, one's a moon, one's a sun, it's amazing, isn't it? It's like, uh, how is it, oh shoot, how is it possible that the moon and the sun are so close to the earth, and oh my god, who, who, who decided to do, wait, actually, what's the name of those, uh, uh, I can't, I can't, dang it, I can't think of the name from Street Fighter, um, well, that joke just failed, oh, well. So, uh, well, I believe they each have their own individual boss life meter. Yeah, like that. Just as I thought. Um, well, I'll just, I'll just call that a Kamehameha as a reference to Dragon Ball Z. Uh, uh, because I just, for the life of me, can't think of that reference that I wanted to do. And as you can see, Mr. Shine up, where I, where I fact, actually forgot which one is which. To be honest, Mr. Shine and Mr. Bright are one of the two, one of the... It's a moon, it's a sun, I don't know. It's, it's, I don't know. Well, they're done. <laughs> Honestly, I never remember, I should say, I never found out who was who. But I know they're Mr. Shine and Mr. Bright. And level four is the grape garden. I guess there's going to be grapes on the clouds or something. I guess that's a garden in the Kirby's world where grapes grow or something like that. Instead of on vines, they grow on clouds. So, number one, here we go. We're up in the sky. Oh, come on. That was just mean. You are not allowed to ambush me. Oh, a green waddle bee. What are you doing here? I think they're a little more powerful or resilient or faster or something. I don't know. But they're a little different, I think. Oh, no, 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 gimme. Wait, did I want that laser power? I guess I'll see. Um, maybe that would have been handy here, but I can get by without it. Uh, sword. I can definitely take you in. Oh, yeah. Uh, now we're in- ah! Ambush! Now we're in outer, outer space. There's a UFO here. Is this some- Where'd you go? What? I was expecting you to fly in- What? No, 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 I don't think so. Alright, now I got the UFO and I can float wherever I want to. Um, is that something that I want? Probably. In the spacey area, especially since it's a, you know, UFO. It kind of makes a lot of sense here. Come on, you gotta think of these things logically. I think there's a door here. No, there's not a door there. I thought there was a door there. What? Whatever. Let's just go forward and uh, look out for those tornado guys. Oh, wait, actually, I'll show you a tornado guy. This is not tech uh, usually a very good power to have because it's it's very hard to control it. If you press the B button, you'll go higher like that, and if you just let it go, you'll go lower. Uh, I mean, I should say you'll descend or you'll just skim across the ground. Um, if you do it in mid-air, as you can see, you can't really, like, control very well. That's, that's why it's not that good of a power. Well, that's the end of the stage. Here we go. Um, four. And I'm just gonna get, get rid of this power right away because it, it's gonna kill me. I know it's gonna... Wait, wait, there's, I'm missing something here. I'm missing something here. Blasphemy! Ah, oh, let's go check it out. Hmm. Give me... Yeah, I, I don't really see anything that hides anything else. Oh, wait, what? Did you see that? There was something hidden behind this block. See that red red thing there? That red planet in the background? Yeah, press up next to it. You'll go inside it. Weird. Well, I guess there was something hidden there, like I thought. Well, there's the secret. Boink! That level is done. Now I can happily leave here with my beam power, hopefully, and go to the next stage. And don't hit me with your tornado powers. And I'm just gonna have to take a hit here. Oh, no, I'm not. I was gonna say I'm gonna have to take a hit here because I have the beam power and regular Kirby would fail over there. Um, because I have to suck the enemies in on my way down. But that would usually cause me to take a hit. So next one, number two, let's go. yoo More awesome Kirby music. Oh, and I lost my power. Dang you. Curse you. Wait, wait what? How do I get in there? Can I, like, no? It's probably, I could probably go through it this way, maybe. Oh, I see, I see. Suck you in. 
and... Oh, no, no, no. Can I, like... There we go. I want to go... Wait, wait. Actually, maybe I don't want to go in there just yet. Is there, any... Is there anything up here that I might miss? Um, uh, no, there's actually nothing. It's just the rooftops. So, okie dokie. Yeah, that was a big waste of time. And I got a bunch of Poppy Brothers Jr. there, roaming around. Is there a door there? No, there isn't. Whenever you see two vertical blocks like there, like that, there's a good chance there's a door behind them. Or at least in some of them, because, you know, Kirby just it has those two square doors. And, well, I shouldn't say there's a good chance. There's a chance that it has them, so... It's definitely worth checking out. And what's this way? That takes me under everything, and then some... Oh, there's a door there. See, that's what I mean. Destroy those blocks. And there's some red Poppy Brothers there. Maximum Tomatoes and some Squishy. Uh, these don't give you any powers, so you can just kill them, but they jump. And that's a pretty vicious attack, you know, jumping. Well, I guess if you have the uh, high jump, you have a pretty good attack. Oh, no, 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 no! Oh, that was a close one. Uh, I don't want that vitamin water that badly to go up there and get it. Although, if I took one hit to get it, you know, it wouldn't be that bad, I suppose. Oh, boy. I'm going to take two hits getting it, or not. Or I can just do, like, a little jump to get between those spikes without taking a hit whatsoever. So, that's pretty helpful as well, I guess. Ooh, double Poppy Brother Senior attack! I'll just go after one at a time. Ooh, I can't, can I? Wait, I, I can, never mind. Give me your power and crash time! Broken boss destroying powers! Wait, oh yeah, I can only use it once, so I guess it's not that broken. Yep, come on, bomb, bomb, bomb. Gimme, gimme, gimme your explosives. There we go. Yay! And through the door I go. Woo! Uh, three! I want number one, dang it! And next stage opens up. And there appears to be something else up here. This is another battle arena. So let's oh it's a quick draw. Excuse me. I always think the swords are the battle arenas, so my bad. Get ready! Four more to go, baby. Oh yeah. You're going down, Wheelie. You're going down. Traveling merchant or traveling guy, you are done. Come on, your Chef Kawasaki. Do your worst. Alright, this was the guy who defeated me last time, Mr. DDD. Yeah, I got you this time. I, my timing's a lot more consistent this time, too, so that helps. Yeah! Woo! That should give me three one ups. My fastest time was 11. Can you beat it? You probably could, if you can. Post a video or a step response down below. You can do that to any part, really, because I've been playing that game in just about every part so far. Um, well, maybe not, just two of the parts, so... I don't know, I'm just being an idiot. Well, wait, 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 I want you. Fire, see that rope? Burn this rope, and the fuse will start going. Go inside this cannon, push down, and wait for the fuse to get to the cannon. Boom! Actually, I was a little bit late at saying boom there, but that's okay. I got the one up. Well, there's one up hidden there. I don't, there's sometimes other secrets hidden there. Whoa, we're on top of blimps! Dangerous blimps of death. There's some blades. Well, maybe these aren't so dangerous. There's just some wind going on here. There's probably a secret around here as well. So let's just explore the wild blue yonder here on top of these blimps. And this appears to be as far down the screen goes. No, 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 no. Give me, give me, give me. Thank you. I would like that firepower. Oh, you know what? Screw it. I don't feel like going back again. Give me your blade instead. You throw. No, not at me. Yeah. There we go. And what's up here? Is there gonna be something? No, just some propellers. And there's a door here. Is that something that I want? It looks like it because there's a maximum tomato. Um. What? How do I get that maximum tomato? Is, this, is there, like, another door to somewhere else? I do not know. Hmm. Mysterious. Is there gonna be, like, a door? No, no! Oh, shoot! I was gonna say, is there gonna be, like, a door underneath there or something like that? Oh, I just pop right back out over here. Well, that's pretty handy. I got 16 lives to burn, so I might as well screw around. Um... 
Oh, uh, I don't know how to get that maximum tomato, nor do I need to get it right now. Well, now I need, now I kind of need to get it. Well, maybe I don't. I got five hits left, and there's a door there. There's a door here. Do I want... Oh, shoot, I can't go back. I was gonna say, is there any of these doors that I want to go into? I guess I'll soon see if this was the right one, or if I missed out on a secret. No, 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 bomb! No! Oh, I missed it. I should say I got hit by it. Not missed it. I should say I screwed up dodging it. It wasn't quite fast enough. There's a warp star. Woo! And no, no laser guy. No, I don't think so. You're not gonna shoot your lasers at me. No fire in your lasers. And what? Go, 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 go. Oh, two. Not bad, but still not good enough. And that, I probably missed a secret there. We'll see in just a minute. Uh, yeah, I did. Let's go back to that blimp area and see what's up. Okay, there's the door I went in last time. And now what is this door down here? If I go in this door, switch! Ah, oh, I should've just went in this door first. But I figure since that was the further away door, I thought that was like the last door I was supposed to go to. But, uh, I guess that's not the case. Um, wait, 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 I don't want to fall, fall down here, I want to go to- Wait, actually, what's, what's down this way, I should say? What's over here? Nothing! Hooray! Oh. <laughs> so I'm gonna go through here and just run through this area just to finish the stage, and that'll be it for this part. Oh shoot! Oh shoot! Shooty shoot! No powers! Now I got the sword! That makes me happy. Don't ask me why these blades don't hurt Kirby, it makes no sense, or I should say these propellers don't hurt Kirby. Do not question the logic! And Warp Star, next area again. So... Where? Oh, I have to go. I have to climb up here to the exit. This was a very easy climb. I just have to avoid some enemies, and there we go. So, hope you enjoyed. See you in the next part. Toodaloo!